So many people when they first see the equation x to the third power is equal to negative one, they might just tell you x is equal to negative one is the answer. And if you ask them to show work, they will just take the cube root to both sides and then cancel, cancel, and they will say x is negative one. If you want them to check the answer, well, they plug in negative one into the x. We get negative one to the third power, which is negative one times negative one times negative one, and we do end up with negative one. So it checks. However, this is not the only solution to this equation. Hmm, what do we mean though? In fact, we also have two more solutions that we don't see it because they are complex. Is it because of the i? Because we have a negative inside of a radical? No. If you are looking at cube root of negative 1, this does not give you the i. Square root of negative 1 does give you the i, but not this. In fact, we will have to do a little bit more work in order to figure out the other solutions. And that's the goal for today. Let's do it. Here we go. We start with the equation x cubed is equal to negative 1. Let's add 1 to both sides, so we get x cubed plus 1 is equal to 0. Notice now we have a sum, and in fact this is x cubed, and we can also look at this as 1 cubed. So this is a sum of 2 cubes. So x cubed plus 1 cubed is equal to 0. And the reason that we do that is so that we can use the sum of 2 cubes formula to factor this. And let me just put that down to remind you guys, when we have a cubed plus b cubed, this is equal to a plus b times a squared minus ab and then plus b squared. Here, our a is dx, the b is 1. Applying this formula, we will just get x plus 1. And then, continue with the x. Square that, minus ab, x times 1, it's just x. And lastly, b squared. 1 squared is just 1. And let me just put that down on purpose like this to show you we are following the formula. And that is equal to 0. Now, we have a product of two things is equal to 0. So that means either the first factor, which is x plus 1, that has to be equal to 0, or the other factor has to be equal to 0. 1 squared is 1, so that's why I write down. OK, from here, subtract 1 to both sides. This is how we get x is equal to negative 1 which is the only real solution to this equation. Now for this right here, we can use the quadratic formula. And I'm also going to remind you guys on the side, if we have ax squared plus bx plus c, it's equal to 0, then x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. Here. A is what? It's a 1, even though we don't see it, but it's 1. B is technically negative 1. And then C is this one. And then applying the formula, we will get X being equal to negative B, which is negative 1. So be careful, we have a double negative. Plus or minus square root B squared, we have to do negative 1 squared minus 4ac. 4, a is 1, c is 1. So multiply by this and that. All divided by 2 times a, which is 2 times 1. Okay, that's just 1, plus or minus square root. Now for the inside, negative 1 square is positive 1. This is minus 4 altogether, 4 times 1 times 1, just 4. So negative 1, Square is 1. I said that twice. I don't know why. 1 minus 4 is negative 3. And then over 2 times 1, which is 2. Now, as I mentioned earlier, when we have a negative inside of the square root, that's the i. So we get 1 plus or minus with the i and then square root of 3 over 2. So we have two complex solutions right here. Okay. 
if you would like to have something that's a little bit more exciting, you could do the following, cube root of negative 1. You can write it as negative 1, or the next number is 1 plus i square root of 3 over 2, and then lastly, 1 minus i square root of 3 over 2. Yeah, cube root of negative 1 is equal to this and this and that. However, though, it depends on which class that you are taking. Sometimes, just do this, all right? However, if you are in a complex analysis, which is like an upper division math class, then it's perhaps okay to write it as cube root of negative 1 being this and then being that. But that will be way later. Anyways, that's it.